Hi, I'm Shira. I'm about to ultrasound Arietta's deep abdominal muscles and pelvic floor using the time ultrasound, which is this machine over here, which is fairly easily accessible these days through uh, most physiotherapy clinics. I'll be putting the probe on her lower abdomen to scan her abdominal muscles, the transversus abdominis and her pelvic floor muscles and to give me feedback about the way she's doing the exercise and Marietta can view the screen herself and she gets instantaneous visual feedback as to the way she's switching those muscles on. Let's have a go. So this is what will happen if you get your real-time ultrasound with for your, for your pelvic floor and your transverse look at through Marietta's abdomen. The probe is here, which is the skin, the surface. As we go down, that's deeper into her abdomen. So we have a, a small layer of adipose tissue or fat, but not much there on you, Marietta. Don't worry about that. Next layer, you've got your external oblique, which is that black line between the white, the black area between the white lines is external oblique. Internal, internal oblique is the second layer of abdominals seen through there which is a fairly thick muscle in this case and then we've got transversus which is the deepest lying muscle um, which is all the way through there so that's through the abdomen abdominal wall when we're looking at contracting the transversus we're looking at that deep layer what what I'm expecting to see is a thickening of that muscle and a sliding action what we don't want to see is the second or third layer get bigger. So the idea with this exercise is that you isolate the transversus without moving the other two layers. Let's have a look. Okay. So Marietta, just relax and take a few just gentle breaths. And on the next one, just contracting, very gently drawing the muscles in between your hip bones. That's beautiful. So we're seeing that nice thickening of that deep transversus muscle and then gently let it go. Good, and again, very slowly and gently drawing in. Hold and breathe. And let it go. Good, now with technology, we can do something a little bit more. So just relax, Marietta. And when you're ready to contract again, just slowly. And relax. So that's you at rest. When you're contracted, you can compare directly that the transversus has got thicker. External oblique has pretty much stayed the same. External oblique, same. So well done, nice contraction. <laughs> <laughs>
Can you now hold your pelvic floor and do a cough? <laughs> <laughs>